hi, I'm Seng. So today I'll show you how to set your printer setting and your order template. Thank you. Okay, first, go to your menu, go to the setting, then click here and select to printer. Okay, first, we will teach you how to set the receipt format. Go to the template and click receipt template. So from here, the header text, you can edit your own, so it will appear at here. For example, so I click ABCD, then you choose at here. Other than that, you also can set on the font size. For example, I added to make it bigger or I make it smaller. Then you also can tick to show the contact. So the contact is disappear. Other than that, you also can click to choose to show address. So it's disappeared. And then you can select to show email or hide the add-on with zero price. For example, this all add-on is zero price. If I turn it on, then you will disappear. Then you also can add the footer text, for example. So it shows here, thank you, please come again. Then you also can put your own logo image at here. And you also can set the logo height and logo width. After that, just click save. Other than that, you also can design your own kitchen printer template. So click here, add template. So I name as kitchen, just click save. So normally, if you want to show the header on the top, just drag it, put on the top, and click here, select on this section, and name it as kitchen. So if the kitchen or the print in the kitchen, it will show on the text at here. Other than that, you also can select to put your own customization. Just click back, and you also can adjust for the overall font size. For example, I put it to 15. Then it become bigger. Or I make it smaller. So it become like this. Furthermore, you also can set for the body and the footer as well. After that, just click save. For the kitchen printer, you also can select for the order template. So I select as kitchen, which is I set just now. So when I'm taking order, so it shows the kitchen name on the top. Go to the printer. So normally we will set up the printer for you for the cashier, drink and kitchen. You can go to the cashier. Normally we will set up the IP address for you. You can set that this cashier printer, you are able to print the bill, the report, the print change table notice, void or order. But order is optional. But normally, if you only have one printer, then you can select the print order directly in your cashier printer. If you have more than one printer that using the LAN cable, you can select set as your backup printer. If your cashier printer using the LAN cable is disconnected, you will print it to the kitchen. After that, just click back, then you will save automatically. So let's say we are setting up for the kitchen printer, just click on it. Set for the IP address. Then you want to select for the print order, so just click on the tick. So you can customize which table to print or which item to print. For example, for this kitchen printer, you want to only print the kitchen order. Click on here and click item. So you can select like let's say I want to only print the noodles, but for the drinks I don't want to print it. So after that, just click confirm. Furthermore, you also can set that you only want to print all items or print only takeaway or print only dine-in. So this one means that maximum quantity in one paper and the split max up after item. For example, if I click like this, so means that each type of the kitchen order will print in one paper. If I'm taking order, then you will print it separately for each type of item for each paper. If I split for one item for max quantity in one paper, so let's say this item I order for two, and this item I order for three, okay, print again. So it will become like that. Furthermore, you also can set a setting like that, which is for each type of item print in one paper. There's one type and one item. So if I order, Send order, then it will create into the form. 
So it is, depends on your own requirement and request. If you want to save for paper, then you set as unlimited. If you turn on this comma item before print, then it will become like this. That's all for today. Thank you. Find hidden for find out. Support system, the